Okay, we're getting a number of reports of the Android device automatically updating to version 12. And when this happens, you will have a blank entry at the top of the screen and a blank entry at the bottom of the screen because you're on previous versions of Timer Pro. What you have to do here is turn off the automatic updates in your device to stop the Android automatically updating here. To do that, the easiest way you've found is to go to Google and just ask for instructions on how to turn it off in your device. Why do you have to ask? Because it seems to change from device to device. No, no two devices are the same here. So the easiest way to go is go to Google and just Google it and then find out the steps and you can click on here. And for instance, in this example, it gives you good details of how to do it. And what you want to do is you want to set your device to do not auto update the apps. Otherwise, it's just going to keep on passing it down to you there. So um, you have to go and you have to make sure that you turn off the automatic updating on your device. Then go back to your device that you have. Bring it back up here. And we need to uninstall the version that's been put on here. And again, you know you've got the version 12 when you have the, uh, the blank at the top and the blank at the bottom here. And it also won't work well on your device here either. So what you do here is you go to the uh, end session down here takes you back out and look for the settings on your device. Go to settings. And again, this may vary by device, but you'll always find somewhere where you've got your application manager, which is in my case here on the Android tablet is this one right here. I select this and it's going to load up all the application you have in your device. Look for the Timer Pro Professional and you want to uninstall that. So this would be this one here and we can go to the uninstall option right here. It's pretty quick. Just say confirm you want to uninstall it, give it a few seconds, and then it will do it. Next, open up your Gmail, and we will have sent you a Timer Pro version 11 APK for Android. And there will be an attachment down here. You'll see it called Timer Pro APK. This is the version 11 program. And because you get the automatic updates turned off, this will not be overwritten once you put it back on. So all you do is you just tap on this and it's going to open up the installer that comes with the device. Give it a few seconds and then it will ask if you want to install that. So you click on the install at the bottom here. This may take a minute depending on your uh, Wi-Fi connection of course. And it says app installed and then we go back to the open here. And now we will be back to the version 11 of the program where the top will be select template and end session. And then you can continue working with the previous version 11.